Welcome to my top eight picks from Maybelline. First up, we have this concealer. You guys, this is less than $10. I use it to clean up my eyebrows, but I also use it on the face. When you let this dry down and then blend it out, it gives you the most beautiful skin-like coverage. Now to add a little brightening effect to the face, I went in with the Viral Pink Concealer. This, I would say, isn't really a concealer. It's definitely more of a brightener because it doesn't really provide a lot of coverage, but it beautifully lifts and elevates the center of the face and anywhere that you blend it out. Now for shaping on the outer edge of the face, you can call this contouring or bronzing. It honestly doesn't matter. To me, it's just about adding dimension anywhere you want to pull back and recess. So for me, that's the jawline, the cheekbones, right underneath the lip, the nose, and the eyes. Once you blend this out, it literally melts into the skin so it doesn't look like another layer of makeup. It just works so effortlessly. And I also love to pinch the brush when I blend out the nose contour to make sure everything's concise. So to lock in all of our concealer and our brighteners, I love the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder. I tap it on and then I press and roll it into the skin. When you do this, you really push the powder particles into that concealer so they kind of lock in place and they won't crease throughout the day. I love this Maybelline Lash Primer. Paired with the Sky High Mascara, it is such a winning combo and it makes me skip false lashes, which is pretty alarming. For lips, I love this neutral shade in Peppy because it's long wearing and super comfortable in the lip I take it for five seconds and apply it to clean dry lips now for a gorgeous glow i love the maybelline master chrome and molten gold this gives you a high shine wet looking glow and it's the best which product was your favorite